everyone. Welcome to another episode of The Darkness of Ravenford from the Lisa Lee Mystery Series. I'm going to say like Edgar Allan Poe stuff next time. I don't have it prepared, but. <laughs> With me right now, we have Joe as playing Silas Hughes. That's me. We have River playing Lady Jesus. I put your name. Lady, Lady, Jesus. Lady Jesus. Lady Jesus. Lady Jesus. She might think so. Jeez. I put your name as acronyms on my note instead of putting the whole name. So it was oh, LPW, man. and I was like, "What the freak is LPW again? <laughs> what the w. heck is this?" Lady Lucille Parker Watson. Lady Lucille Parker Watson of the Watt Parker Watson industry and luxury. We have Lucky as Sam Mason. Hi, I can never remember my character's voice, so it might be different from the last episode. We'll see. That's fine. <laughs> I don't know voice either. I think it's and just then... your voice, but anxiety. So my voice. Yes. <laughs> I wasn't going to say it. <laughs> I was looking at this. <laughs> And then we have Dalton as Thomas Ames. Hello. Ooh. <laughs> this I is love where that. my voice is going to be today. Similar to and Dad, my voice my has voice. been kind of all over the place this entire playthrough. <laughs> that's like... Okay, that's yeah, like that was a, pretty good. Like a, like, like a more subdued Snape. Oh, <laughs> oh. Ah, that would be fun. <laughs> and and we also have with us the... Bob the Knight. I'm rolling for initiative. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay, I'm sorry. Good. Bob the Knight has to have some respect. Not Snape. I, I thought you said snake, like the box snake, but you meant Snape. My bad. Yeah. I, I love I love your correlation to solid snake is box. Box. box That's so funny. <laughs> funny. I love yeah, that. Bob, like, genuinely. Bob the Knight, not great. Bob the Drag Queen fans. Sorry, I can't afford Bob the Drag Queen. So, our, in our last episode, our hero detectives entered a school. Ugh, who wants to go to school? And realized that it's a little bit creepy here. They met some evil bully ghost. They went through and found out there is a spirit festival coming soon at the same time as someone named Sierra's birthday party and it feels like no one wants to go they found a bunch of signs that says that they're a loser they don't want to go they went to a classroom found out more bullying happening and uh who was it it was silas who decided to change the writing on a chalkboard to something nice and Forgot what, i think i changed like i really you like put really it maybe Sarah Rock, to... but I didn't understand it. <laughs> oh yeah, you <laughs> turned Sarah like Rock's Spongebob. Into Rock. uh, what what yeah. does Rocks mean in this context? Um, yeah, it okay. was like, what? <laughs> so it was supposed to be like, yeah, you rock. Uh, uh, but with like yeah. the really like grim kind of Salem witch trials vibe of this thing, it kind of gives a different like... Oh my like, god. Rocks oh, has a different... No. I don't know, I regretted that joke after oh. I heard it later. <laughs> Oh no. oh no! I didn't take it as that. I think you were the only one, maybe, that took it like that. I took it as in, yeah, they rock. So okay, good, because <laughs> I'm glad I'm just overthinking my own joke. Uh, yeah. So you guys <laughs> went into that room. You went out of the classroom, and that door took you to another part of the school, in front of the principal's office. You guys walk into the principal's office. Uh, Silas had to roll for fear of darkness. He overcame his fear since he has Bob the Knight with him. Then you guys got trapped into the room. You met the principal and now you guys are being told by three different voices to kill the principal due to him being worthless or whatever. You know, just mean stuff. Bully say. Didn't, 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 the, didn't the principal also have like several dates that he... he... Oh yeah, he got he stood up for it, right? He got stood he up for it, but he still <laughs> tried. <laughs> and you guys kept smelling their cologne the entire time, and you probably wonder maybe that's the reason why you have no dates. <laughs> uh, also, Silas kept bouncing in between the windows because Silas tried to jump through, thinking, "Oh, I can break it," but whatever, <laughs> is in there. I just haven't tried right hard enough. 
You can't right now. <laughs> I haven't. It's just eventually it's going to happen. It, it's a race. Either it's going to break or I'm going to get a concussion. That's that's where the limit is. One of those two. So now we are here. That's where we last started. You guys are now trapped in the principal's office. The principal tried to stop you guys from getting into one of the drawers before this whole situation happened. The principal is cowering. You guys also found, I think you guys found something in the plant. You did, you found something in the fake plant that was being watered, but it wasn't real. Oh, so there's like mold. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What was the thing? I believe you guys found a, a, several keys. It was a uh, ring of keys. So the ghosts want us to kill this principal. The principal is keeping us from opening up uh, like a drawer that I'm presumably we're going to use the keys to open. So, yes, uh, S S Sam, Sam, you, you, you're the pouch that's on your side keeps keeps uh, raggling on, and it's it's mostly. Yeah. Talk to talk to. Him. Okay. Hi, open up. All right, guys. Um. Man. This is gonna be weird. No, it's not. Really, really sorry about this. Um, no, he takes out, he takes the pouch, and like puts it in his other hand. They're like, he, he puts it in his other hand. He obviously doesn't want to be anywhere near it. His arm is like fully extended with it away from him, and he pulls a string to open up, and the cloth unfolds, and inside is a shrunken head. <gasps> How you I doing, hot stuffs? And. <sighs> This this hey. head looked over at at uh, Thomas. Hey, how you doing? Wink. Uh, <laughs> Licks hey, and they leave their their dry lips. No. Silas is taken aback until he's complimented about being hot and he's comfortable now. Oh oh, you too. Oh, meat cakes right there, baby. <laughs> I, I, I take my cane and like. I take my cane and like pretend it's like a barbell that I'm like overhead lifting just as an excuse <laughs> to show off muscles. Oh yeah, I like this one. This is the Oh my god. I point it, I point it at uh, Sam. What on earth is this? And why have you been keeping it from us? Excuse me, I'm a who? Not a it? Rude. Uh, this is my great, great Great, 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 grandma. Yeah, I think we have the right amount of crates. I think. Yeah, I'm reading your uh, <laughs> background. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What up? Um. Uh, I, I'm here, cause this fat guy, and I'm gonna roll for the principal to see if he uh, for a fright check, see if he passes out. Okay, he doesn't. No, he's fine. This is screaming. <laughs> I'm over here because this guy is he's lying to you guys. He's hiding something. He's hiding something and he's not sharing with you. And it's driving me nuts because I want to know. Do we have like a gossip ghost? Gosh, I'm gossip. <laughs> is she, she's not a ghost. I'm not. I'm a head. I'm a woman. Yeah, I'm she's, a she's very much alive. Kind of can't die. Nope. Um, I don't pay taxes but... either. Ha <laughs> 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 well, Long story short, um, why? Well, how do I make this short? <laughs> uh, should... You should try to help her find stuff. Um, yeah, she assists you guys in finding certain things that uh, you guys probably didn't see or you missed. So, yeah. She, she's kind of like a. Uh, Bookum's detector. Okay. Well, I, I turn to the principal, and I don't remember his name, but uh, I take my cane and kind of poke him with the end of it. Like, you heard the lady. Yeah. Out with yeah. it. What? No, I don't I don't know what you're talking about. I, just, I, don't, I don't know. Well, I don't know what I'm talking about either, but come out with it and poke him again. <laughs> oh, stop. I'm already <laughs> bruised up. Look at my cuts and bruises. And they're just like small little cuts and one little bruise from hitting the ed edge of the desk. Yes. I'm going to give him a real bruise. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to smack him on his thigh with my cane. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> okay. Uh, let me see if he rolls for dodge. He doesn't. <laughs> 
I was really hoping this would be the time where we realize he's secretly a ninja. <laughs> Teleports behind me, nothing personal, kid. I know. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, you whack him. How, how are you gonna whack him? Are you gonna whack him hard? Are you gonna whack him? I, I'm, I'm not. I'm not trying to like do damage. I'm just trying to give him a real bruise. Like, like all, all of his cuts are like paper cuts or like him stubbing his toe. I'm gonna give him like a bruise that's gonna last for like a week. And he's I just gonna be bruised like a banana. I was gonna say you do the <laughs> If or I him, end up breaking just... his leg, that's also fine. Like, <laughs> <laughs> I just want to give him a bruise. That's it's fine. Like, fine. I just want to give him a bruise. <laughs> well, you don't you don't break his leg, but he does get four damage because uh, as as oh he did, he's gonna yell. I have iron deficiency and I'm allergic <laughs> to the sun, and I can't be in the dark for too long because that's bad for my complexion. That's probably why I can't get a date. It's nothing, no, the reason why. Wait, I thought being inside was better for your complexion. I can't be in or out. So you just like bring a bring an umbrella with you everywhere? Is that the solution? And in doorways constantly. <laughs> yes. That's the people think I'm a vampire, but I don't like blood. I get woozy. I've I've met vampires, you're not there. That's oh. a lie, I haven't met any vampires. I really don't want to. Oh, you're a liar. I don't like it. You're you're allowed out with it, and I know like, the things. I raise my cane to hit him again, but I hold back and wait for him to talk. I raise my great times five grandma towards him. <laughs> I'm like down with it, and she's gonna roll intimidation along with the help of uh, uh Silas. I keep saying Simon. It's not Simon, Silas. Ooh, eighteen. Yeah, yeah, that was pretty good. Uh, so he goes and he's, when you guys are intimidating him, he keeps looking back at a certain drawer that is in the very, 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 very top of <laughs> all his head drawers on top behind him, which I don't understand why, but you know what, whatever, it's his interior design. I'm not going to judge him. No, I will. <laughs> but... Thomas, Thomas has the keys, right? Yes, I believe so. Because he had the, the, the super eyes and found he it. He had the special yes. eyes. That's yes. all that I'm good for is just my special eyes. <laughs> Walk into a room. Oh, everybody, just Thomas, what do you see? <laughs> Thomas, but Thomas, yes, I, I what do you keys. see? <laughs> I spy with my little eye. I mean, I have keys. Come on, let's spy with my little eye. Large on power. Power. Keys, I'm oh, where are those? Do you see those drawers behind the desk, the chair? So mm -hmm. behind there, there's another layer on top of the second layer here that you guys, I didn't want to draw. So. <laughs> so I didn't want to draw the thing you specifically need to go into. Yeah, I didn't want to draw it because I was already committed to this style. And then after I figured out, oh my gosh, I need to draw another one. I said, nah, it's fine. <laughs> You're good. You're good. So it's valid. So valid. Thank you. Thank you. So Thomas, when you go up to that drawer, it's actually to your head face because the principal is only 411 and everything to this individual is is very very tall so you don't need to go on thomas's i mean uh silas's back this time even though you were very tempted just to go back on it <laughs> now so, you go ahead i'll just do, do, can i can i can i make an appeal to this weasley little principal that like hey uh there's four of us plus a little ghost knight and a disembodied head uh, <laughs> and there's only one of him and he bruises easily as he's already <laughs> demonstrated uh, and there's there's spooky ghost children telling us to kill him so it's in his best interest if he just tells us which drawer and which key so I don't have to sit here fumbling <laughs> around with <laughs> 10 keys and oh, which drawer is this oh no I, <laughs> not this you, one you, oh. oh man Definitely. I want the key sifting montage <laughs> yeah, you can. What are you gonna do? You can find any way to appeal this individual to get their certain key. Well, I would just, I would just tell him that oh, we we right. are capable of inflicting pain oh. on him. Uh, my my associate here has already demonstrated he's got a good swapping cane. Um, Sam over there's got a big heavy book he can hit you with. Like we can inflict all sorts of physical pain on you, and and we've and we've got actual reason too because these ghost children are telling us to kill you. So we all 
it's in our best interest, your best interest, if we work together on getting out of here and figuring out what's going on, rather than just us just just murdering you, and then we're free no, to go. It, it can't let anyone know. No, you can't figure it out. You can't. It's gonna ruin everything for me. Is it worse than dying? Maybe. <laughs> well, <laughs> well, there you Hold go. On. All right. Man, <laughs> All right. I've, I've got a wrench. <laughs> <laughs> that that's. <laughs> <laughs> he got a wrench and just start coming at him. Roll for intimidation with your wrench. Okay, is that a D twenty? C. Alrighty. Well, give me a good one. Give me a good. One, give me a good one. That's a six. Oh, he rolled defense for twelve. Can can <laughs> he have advantage because we're literally surrounding him in like a beat the shit out of him kind of way. <laughs> yeah. We're like all yeah. like surrounding him and looking down at him like, mm. all right, Silas, I'm going to get behind his legs and then you push. <laughs> I'll fucking push him all right. <laughs> oh, yeah. You can roll again because you have probably three help actions. The from team. One. Yeah. Okay. Bob Come is on. just stabbing you know, I'll even, their legs. I'm going to do it with a different paradise because I, I really don't think it ought to be that difficult to intimidate this little dandelion of a man. It's another six. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Is this yeah. is this the principal's um God, what is the Spider Man thing? Canon event? <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> yes, how'd you know? No. <laughs> uh, and he stops. Actually. Help me help help me become a better guy to get dates. And I'll tell you. I'll tell you what to do. Okay, cool. Sure. Women yeah. like men with scars, and I hit him again. <laughs> <laughs> oh, doesn't <Yeah>. dodge. <laughs> can, can you roll d d6 for me, Joe, to show how much damage on top of four damage you caused him earlier? Another oh four. <laughs> okay. Wow. Um, I'm going to roll consciousness check hold on okay he's, he's still doing good his health is only 10 you he only has two left okay oh my god oh god that's fine uh, hey you know what ghost he might, might really do exactly this guy. what you want us to do yeah. after all okay okay i'm sorry i'm sorry okay fine 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 i'll i'll, I'll stop just stop I'll, I'll tell you i'll tell you and he goes over to grab the keychains but he looks back at your grandma's head uh lucky and goes do, do you think i'm attractive you told them they were. Are, are you really asking a mummified head? If... Hey, I'll take anything, sweetheart. So, and mm -hmm. he winks at him. I, 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 I put her back in the claw. No, no, no. Oh, okay, that makes me kind of, kind of feel better. You put some lotion. Thanks, on. Grandma. And he pulls out all the keys, unlocks the drawer that he keeps looking at and he pulls out all these papers and lays it on the desk for you guys and as he does that he's going to cower back in the corner but instead of facing you guys he goes completely quiet and just faces the corner so as you guys are reading you're finding out that there's a bunch of crumbled paper of several a lot of a lot of complaints probably like years of complaints from a student named sierra about being bullying and ask and asking for help and it seems that it goes from being her food being thrown away in front of her having stuff thrown at her people waiting to mess with her as she walks home you can also see that she's asked the teacher and principal for help but none of them has done anything to help her at all. I'm, I'm gonna take a loose piece of paper on the desk and with a pen, I'm gonna write down on it karmic justice, uh, wad it up and throw it at the principal. Oh, that's <laughs> two damage <laughs> paints. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah, but when you throw it at him, he just starts sobbing and doesn't react to what you were doing. I, uh, uh, Thomas, roll for perception, please. Ooh, rolling for a regular perception. Oh my god. So what are your what special is it? If you would like to add your D6 for extra lights. Jeez. I would say it works here because the office is still technically dark. 
because I don't think we ever were able to turn the lights on other than the glowing windows. Oh, also uh, 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 th a thing occurs from uh, the last time. I got zapped, right? Didn't I get zapped? You did, but uh, wait, wait. Silas helped you get over, like, no, I, I helped. No, no, I helped. Was, he helped Lucille. Lucille. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Never mind. Yeah, you do. So you get minus three. Oh well, cool. Because the D six cool. gave me a three. So. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh oh. What did you get originally. There was one. No. Oh, <laughs> oh no. Um, uh, I'm starting to think remember, I'm not necessarily cut out for this job, fellas. I come in here with my disguises. Oh, in my eyes. You're doing great, buddy. And I'm not contributing very much. This is not the kind of environment necessary for my skills. <laughs> you also have a luck just every episode. Oh, yeah. Every episode we have now. a reroll. Yeah. You have a reroll luck, and we will add depending um, how much the situation sure. calls for. But as okay. a you to call it now or no. It's real early to be using the luck today, but I mean, a one is abysmal. Uh, Sure, fine. Okay, I'll use a luck. I'll use a luck. Okay. So I just, just re-roll on the d20 then? Yes, re-roll the d20, and you can re-roll your d6. Okay, and the d6. All right, all right. I swear to God, dice. <laughs> Negative six. <laughs> I swear. <laughs> Talking just, to your dice in character. I swear, just, just, just give me something Give me something decent. I'm not even looking for a 20. Just something like above a 10 would be, be nice, please. Thank you. And that's an 11 plus a 2. There we hey, go. Yay, that's, that's minus bad. minus three. Well, no, he doesn't have to get this minus this time. Okay. So we're using the luck. We don't want to ruin our luck because then it would defeat the purpose. Okay, okay. Yeah. So okay, thirteen. That's not bad. Okay. Against all odds, I achieved mediocrity. Mediocrity. <laughs> so you're going through all these files, and you see on the bottom a really? blank paper of reports about students how they're doing and stuff so it kind of kicks you to maybe look back in a drawer to see maybe there might be more in there and you do grab a handful more of paper that the principal did not grab you read that the principal actually have been sending reports to sierra's family that she's been doing fantastic she's having so many friends and that she has no issues whatsoever at the school and that she is do just having a blast and that he cannot wait to go to more of their fundraisings that they have at the butcher shop and All hopefully right. that they get uh, the, the new cigars from the west coast or whatever and yeah he the there's a note from the Yolan family thanking him and just saying we'll see you at the next event the family's having because the family always has big grand events for anyone that's making sure that the family members are comfortable in so that doesn't sound like what Sierra is going through uh you are pathetic I was feeling bad for the verbal and physical abuse we were inflicting upon him, but now I'm not so bad, to be honest. I, I, I think you still got two health points that we can work with. <laughs> <laughs> so, so like, like, like the framing of this entire getting a little meta. The framing of this entire campaign is like, hey, you, you, you go to a place, you save a person, send them to the shed. I don't think we have to go like 100% anymore. I'm like, I'm like, kind of okay yeah. with dropping ones. <laughs> Me. Oh my God. <laughs> hundred percenting this. <laughs> We're just aiming for completion. Yeah, this is moral completionist. This, this is, is more, yeah, this is a moral completion. It doesn't have to be <laughs> what the one hundred percent completion of the program is, but no. <laughs> uh, hey Thomas, I need you to roll uh, another perception for me, and just a d twenty, and the principal just... needs to roll perception as well. You're asking a lot. <laughs> <Fuck that. laughs> okay. uh, tell you what, what if I roll it on this side of the table? What if this side of the table is the better one? It's a nine. A nine. Mm. So as you read through that part of what's happening to Sierra, another earthquake and lightning strikes through. But through the windows, uh, something like earlier when you guys went through the door, the a little portal to creepy hands that doesn't look like normal hands. It doesn't look like the hand that you guys saw earlier. Both grabs you and the principal and 
and uh, drags you towards the portal and just slams you against the wall. And the voice to the rest of the party goes, Choose. Your time's running out. <laughs> okay. I've never had an easier decision in my life. <laughs> I think we yeah, all know man. who we're picking. <laughs> the only thing stopping me is that I, I, I need to find something that hits harder than my cane. Uh... <laughs> oh my god. Can I, can I <laughs> open my plant book? Pod? See, oh, this is the, the, these are the same claws that we saw earlier, right? Uh, they're almost similar to the claws like you saw earlier, but they're kind of different. Because the one you saw was in the beginning. It was yeah. a different color. This one, these are different shades. Oh, guys, it's, it's a shiny. Work. Oh, hey. It is a shiny. <laughs> it will for Master Ball. <laughs> Don't evolve it. It's going to look bad. Uh, <laughs> that's true. Or the colors um, in the color. I'm going to go to my book and see what the different color means. Ooh. Yes, roll. Roll, fool. If anyone wants an 11. Oh, wait, I roll a d6 because it's uh my book it's your right? strength it's your super supernatural strength uh 15 hmm. total 15 total you are getting kind of the same feeling from the previous it's coming from some sort of inner anger from within human consciousness but it's also just it feels lonely at the same time you also feel a strong urge that they're going to cause more damage, but you also feel like, no, they just they just need a hug. But I don't think you want to hug a hand. <laughs> but you can't exactly find out what creature it is because your book keeps going in between the last monster you guys fought and the hands that you saw earlier, but they're not pointing out exactly which which kind it is. But you you know it's in your book somewhere. It just won't reveal itself. Okay. I slowly raise my cane and I'm looking over to Sam. Just the uh, Samson, are, are are we good? Are you talking to the 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 portal thing? Do we do we really need to do this? Like, I get you're probably alone, but taking somebody by force isn't going to make you feel better. You, you see that the glow after hearing that there's there's a voice that says I don't wanna I, and, I want to and the other voice goes yes <laughs> that's me <laughs> within us there are two wolves <laughs> the there's light Silas up. and there's Sam <laughs> <laughs> the light around the windows starts to to dull just a little bit from hearing that and I'm going to roll for lightning shock on Thomas and the principal oh god damn it oh, you oh feel in a, that case you feel I... a tingle but nothing happens both of you guys are just it's like an electric like when you rub your feet on the rug too long and you zap someone on accident that's kind of how it feels like right now oh I hate that <laughs> hey, hey guys oh. I think this is less about saving Thomas and condemning the principle and more saving the spirit right now. Silas uh, looks because, conflicted. <laughs> because that spirit just, it, it, it's, so it's like the, those last claws, but it's it, it, there's more of a lonely presence behind it. I think that might be the little girl. Sierra. Yeah. Who rocks. If, <laughs> if she... <laughs> You still don't know the context of that, but it, she, if she does something like this, I think that'll be bad for her. As you guys do say this, and uh, Silas finally clears out that they meant to write, uh, they rock, so that kind of helps comfort. The principal office starts to shake, and I need Dalton, can you roll... A d20 for resistance. I'm gonna oh, do boy. Hey. <clears throat> it's a four. 
a Jesus. four. You should whoa, be rolling whoa, whoa, whoa. a d20. Yeah. Dice <laughs> 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 you're rolling. This is a d5? I don't even know if that, is that, is that possible. <laughs> Go, Tin. Come on, man. I told you to put the d5 away. <laughs> the d2. So, that's just a coin. That's just a coin. <laughs> put the away. You ain't getting no tips for this. When the shake happens, the hands begin to lift Thomas from the wall and takes him through the portal. But the principal no. is able to wiggle their way out and fall out. And as they uh. fall, they uh, <laughs> yeah. like, do that noise again, no one talk. Uh. Yeah. <laughs> I love that. It's uh, a good one. So, it's a good one. So the principal falls to their knees and bows down and starts apologizing. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I know what I did was wrong. I know what I did was wrong. It looks at uh, uh, Silas and goes, please don't hit me. Hold on. Just let me let me just do this real quick. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I don't think anything I can say can, can, can for me. Have you forgive me? If if this is what it takes that you have to end me, do it. Uh, and just lays on the ground. I, oh, I, no. uh, uh, before, no, no, before no. he lays on the ground, I take him by the face and shove him out of the way. Out of my fucking way! And I just dive in through the portal that took Thomas. <laughs> Whoa. No. Whoa. Okay. Whoa. Whoa. Um, the, so, for Lucky and River, uh, sorry, let me go with uh, Lady Lucille <laughs> and Sam. Wait, I don't need to say Sam like that. Lady Lucille and Sam. You guys. <laughs> 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 yeah, you gotta say my name special. <laughs> yes, I have to say your name special. The door <laughs> unlocks behind you, and you see all the portal and electricity leaves. And you guys go into the hallway, and you hear us. You hear Thomas's scream from the uh, uh, to another location. <laughs> That's coming <laughs> from the previous the previous classroom you guys were in. Uh. Tom, not Thomas, gosh dang it. Silas, I need you to roll your d6 for me really quickly. Just the d6? Yeah, just the d6. Two. Two. When you, <laughs> when you go through the portal, it drops you back in the front of the school. <laughs> oh, uh, is, is, is Thomas there? <laughs> no, Thomas is in the classroom. In a different room. <laughs> a different room. Uh... <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna drag the principal with us. Yeah, I was about to say we shouldn't leave him alone just in oh, case. Oh no, no, he is he's going to make up for what he did, one hundred percent. As okay, and he he's not going to resist. He's okay. still bowing his head and just sobbing and apologizing and hoping he, for forgiveness. Where's the knight? Did the knight go with? Uh, oh yeah, with Thomas. Thomas, no, with Thomas. The, the knight went with uh, Silas, and as you guys fall into the front, his uh, Bob's helmet tightens, and he can't open it, and he keeps running into the walls with his sword, still trying to defend. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, my lord, where art thou? Where are we? I'm just gonna run straight back into the into the school and start looking for Thomas. You're not gonna grab grab Bob with you. Oh, I'm assuming he's uh, uh, it, it, he's running around. I'm gonna like take him by the scruff, like l like a puppy, like how um how, like Aww. mother dogs like like lift up their puppies. Oh yes, ah yes, Lord Silas, thank you. I'm forever grateful for you. My Come, sir Bob, we have someone to rescue. <laughs> <laughs> this... <laughs> yes, 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 yes. <laughs> you go and every door that you see, Silas, real quick is is glowing. So the, the 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 yeah, pick a door, pick a door, pick any door. What the hell? Door number one. Door number one or door number two. Door number three. Is this me or Sam? You. Uh, you. Oh, oh, okay. Uh, so do I recognize these doors? Uh, they look like the classrooms that you guys seen earlier, but they all are glowing with these with these portals. Uh, I'm gonna go in the one that we went to previously. Previously, yeah, okay. You go into the classroom that you were in earlier, which is number three. Mm -hmm. You enter, and the portal takes you back to the principal office. Okay. 
Uh, you see, you, <laughs> you see Lucille and Sam and dragging the principal around the corner. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, so through your through your perspective, I jump in through a portal, disappear, <laughs> and then just a few seconds later, I reappear and just rush past you. Uh, I don't understand how these portals work. Brain off. I'm just gonna pick a door. <laughs> what the hell? That's fine. You're with uh, Lady Lucille and Wait. Sam now. Silas. Oh. <laughs> I'm going to As... rush in through door number one if if I'm given next opportunity. Otherwise, I'll wait patiently. Yeah, you guys are walking through the hallway back. And yeah, you have option one, two, or three. And you, if you guys want to go with what Silas says, then that is up to you. Yeah, uh, I, I mean, uh, we're I, my focus is, is dragging the principal. Yeah. Okay. Uh, you go through the door number one. It says classroom A5, but you guys go through it anyway. You go through, and it takes you to the classroom you guys were looking for the entire time. And as you guys enter through... Uh, let me see. So when you guys are going through the door, Silas, you will always get electrical current that goes through you, but it's been rolling low. As you guys go through this current that leads you to where Thomas was taken to. It was an uh, 18, so you guys all have Oof. been shocked by really? the portal. Uh, River, you were already shocked before, so... Yeah, and then I got healed. <laughs> and then you got healed, but then you're gonna get shocked again. So. Oh, no. And uh, I need you guys to roll for resistance real quick. All right, and that's just a single d20? Yeah, it's a single d20. Walsh. Eight. Natural 20. Oh, Fuck you. Silas had me. Vaseline rubbed all over him in the process of it. <laughs> <from> Bob. <laughs> <laughs> what the heck? He's so slippery. Just Bob kidding. the Vaseline Knight. <laughs> Ew. Uh, Silas, you just, you ran through the portal and goes, I'm not done. And it just doesn't even touch you. And what did you get, Sam? Uh, eight. Eight? Uh, uh, yeah, Lady Lucy. <laughs> yeah, Lady Lucy. Uh, I got a 16. 16? All right, you're Whoa. good. You know what? The lightning was like, we're not going to bother with you. You had help last time. So <laughs> it's fine. Don't worry about it. We're good. So for you, Lucky, anytime you try to... When it's your turn, it's going to be minus three to every single roll for the next few uh, rolls. And what about the as, principal? oh, I dare what ask what about the principal? <laughs> he's let's do a conscious trip. <laughs> uh, he's passed out. Oh, I great. slap him awake. Uh, hey, yep, he wakes up. You're not. What? You are staying awake from this sh for this shit. You I caused didn't ask this. For this. <laughs> I didn't yes, ask you did. Pass out. I yes, didn't ask you pass did. Out. I wanted to be awake for this. This is your fault. Stay no. away. Keep I going. I know. It's, it's my fault. I didn't, I didn't, uh, he starts crying. Yeah, good. Yeah. Good. Fucking cry. <laughs> As you guys enter, you see Thomas is being held by a three-headed creature. I'm being the... held by a three-headed creature. <laughs> <laughs> we can see that. <laughs> a body that is made from a Whoa. doll. Whoa. 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 Crazy. <laughs> Hold on. Oh my god. There's a lot to unpack with that. Oh yeah. Jeez. As you guys enter, you hear all three head talking sinistry. The one on the left with the spiked teeth just more playtime. The one whose mouth is kind of sewed. It's not sewed completely. It's sewed to a point where she can talk in a very low ah we can play with these people it's gonna be fun new people yay and then the new the the little elephant is just oh gosh <laughs> oh dear you guys should have come oh, oh my oh, go make my house of sticks uh yeah so 
combat time. Everyone roll for initiative. Honestly, this creature is only like a little bit more messed up than most ghost Pokemon at this point. Uh, nine on initiative. Nine. I got a two. God. Two. I know. Bad dice. Bad oh, dice. Oh. Put it in the jail. Put it in the slime jail. Am I also okay. doing initiative since I'm being yeah. held? Okay, yes. I got a nine as well. Who else got a nine? Me. Joe. I got a so ten. Ten, and then it's going to be Silas before you, Thomas, because you are captured. Then Lucky, yeah. and then um, the monster got a 14, so... Oh, oh shit! Quick, quick question: Which hand yep. is it holding me with? Because um... <laughs> the baby doll hand, no, <laughs> the baby <laughs> hand. <laughs> this, the, the, this one, the gray hand, the one that's actually spiky the, with long hair. Okay, <laughs> I figured the one that's capable. Not a, not a scary movie two situation. Oh uh, yeah, the the creature was going to maybe throw Thomas across the room towards you guys, but nah, they want to play with Thomas just a little longer. Oh. Well, I don't like the sound of that. <laughs> <laughs> so as you as you see, uh, they see a creature. It's not a little creature. It's a big creature. It's a scary creature. The left head is going to go first. Six. Now, it was going to throw pollen at you guys by screaming out this this very. It looks like pollen. It's pinkish. It goes to you guys. Um, as the pollen is releasing to you guys, there's electric current to it but it doesn't reach you guys in time the only <laughs> one it reaches is thomas and i need you. <laughs> damn <laughs> i need you to roll thomas uh d20 to see if it actually affects you or you saw in time to cover your mouth i've already been zapped enough today thank you <laughs> 10 10 you rolled more than it's pollen so no you saw it you held its breath you have your breath, not it. Sorry, you're not coming. <laughs> I put my hand up to its face and was like, no, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> it bites your hand off. No, I'm kidding. Uh, yeah, that one doesn't do anything to you, so you're fine. The middle, multiple eyes, so the mouth, is going to do nothing. It was going to attack, but it's still staring at Thomas. Uh, oh, lovely. And we have our little stuffed animal. Ooh, this stuffed animal cannot hear, but it's really loud. It lets out a loud, loud scream, and it's as he's screaming. Of course, electrical currents go through the, the scream, and as he's screaming, he's apologizing to you guys. Everyone roll for Ow, Dodge, not me. Calm down, Dice. Roll for Ow. Roll for Owie. Roll for Owie. Roll for Owie. 12. 12? 12. Nice. You're good. I have I swells. Yay. <laughs> what did... What did you get, Thomas? And uh, uh, I got an eight. Eight? You? T oh no, Thomas. <laughs> <laughs> Thomas is having a real yeah. thing. Guys. <laughs> it it goes through your eardrums. Oh wait. Uh, before I continue, Silas, what did you get? Nineteen. Oh, you <laughs> Silas is got Vaseline, got earplugs. <laughs> <laughs> where did you get all those? And where did you get all that? Daily routine for Silas. <laughs> yeah. He's got to get. He's he's got. These are all his just before bed things. Yeah, Vaseline, it, 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 it's plug. the beauty routine. It, it's the Parker Watson daily beauty routine kit. <laughs> I don't remember this routine. You take another four damage. Wee. And everything is going to be a little muffled for you for the next turn. Cool. When, you're, when your turn rolls around, after your turn is done, you got tinnitus. You got, yeah, you got tinnitus. Ah. <laughs> uh, that's the monster's turn. We go to Lucky. Uh, ba, 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 ba. Sam, right? I forgot my oh, yeah, name Sam. for a second. Sam, Sam, uh, Sam. Sam, uh, he sees this monstrosity before us, and he looks at the elephant. Hey, guys. Do you guys remember seeing an elephant earlier in the classroom? Yeah, I think I... No, it was in a locker or something. I think I kept it. Pretty sure you kept it or I kept it. One of us... Thomas. Thomas yeah. And we figured that was... Uh, sorry, I can't... I can't Sierra? Sierra? Me, Lucky, cannot remember her name. It was Sierra's... Um, Sierra. It was Sierra's stuffed animal, yeah? 
I think probably avoid uh, injuring the stuffed animal part at the very least. Or like return, like like sew the bits up <laughs> or something. Yeah, that too. The best I can do is um, he's going to take the book out. He's going to try and summon a something again, if that's cool. Yeah, go ahead. Roll your d20 and d6. Maybe Bob can get a friend. Oh, that's no! 21. Tw natural 20 on the d20 and a 1 on the 6. Wow, that's, that's pretty good. Uh, for this roll, would you like to come up with your own creature? Ooh. Um. I'm not drawing it, by the way. Just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> um. So he, Sam is not super into violence, which is why he's always trying to get shit done with diplomacy. Uh, he's going to summon a spirit that is I uh, see you're just going to summon like the actual ghost of Socrates <laughs> <laughs> so she's she's feeling she's lonely she's been bullied this entire time um probably so, a spirit some sort of spirit of of joy. But w w people give me adjectives. An, an angel with, adjectives. With, with an angel with raven wings. Uh, because <laughs> we're in a school of those types of adjectives. <laughs> it's joy and passion. benevolence. Yeah. Blender. And, yeah, benevolence. Yeah, yeah. Blender. Yeah. Blender. 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 <laughs> Like, what is I'm blender? a giant spirit of a blender. <laughs> <laughs> Put him in the blender. <laughs> oh God. Uh, he has something is uh, some sort of spirit to uh, drive away loneliness and and wrath. I'm Barney assuming this thing's dinosaur. not going to be here for very long. A spirit comes from your book as you are reciting through, and the spirit is just very bright in colors rainbows everywhere fairy wings you know you name it has a little halo on top why not she huh. she appears and she looks at the the creature that you're going and she goes Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> you know i Ugh. think this is probably the least scariest thing that's come out of this book and what would you like for this individual to do? Would you like for them to attack? Would you like for them to talk? Or would you like for them to just... What would you like them particularly to do? I would like it to protect us from any... Uh, like the, those boar effects, the lightning and all that. Like just so, focus on protection. Okay. So she's going to... Yeah, so anytime you guys are getting attacked... She can protect, but depending how well she rolls, she can only protect a certain amount of people. But she will always be protecting Sam because Sam is the main uh, caster. Cool. She she waves her wand and magic rainbows and the unicorn in the back. Just Yay. Yeah. Glitter goes in your guys' eyes and all you see is happiness. <laughs> happy, yeah, I, happy, I happy. Even though it's a nat 20, I don't want it to be over like super broken and overpowered. So I think that that's... That's good. That's, yeah, that's pretty good. Okay, that's good. Uh, Silas. Si si yeah, Silas. Silas. Uh, I I'm gonna run in, see everything, and that it and that uh, Thomas is b being held hostage. I'm gonna grab uh the principal by like the back of his torn up jacket, and then just kind of heave him toward the creature. I'll, I'll trade you. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Are you still? Oh, no, we don't want to get rid of him. We just gotta pay for what he's done. Yes, he. Dying what is, do you think this is? Dying is not paying for it. <laughs> dying is a release. Okay. I would rather him get off dead and scot free and keep Thomas alive. <laughs> you know what? That's fair. True. Uh, can you roll a d20 to see how successfully that is? Uh, the principal didn't resist, so. Uh, considering this is like 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 fighting skills, can I get my d6 involved? Yeah, if you can explain to me how this is a fighting 
Oh, the, okay. Instead of it just being like just a throw, I'm gonna like harken back to my tactical suplex uh, from oh. the first episode, and then just turn it into a throw. <laughs> okay, yeah, yeah, you can do that. Not drawing that, but yeah. <laughs> okay, so I rolled a total of a six, but I'm feeling lucky. <laughs> Excuse you. <laughs> Uh, I'm feeling lucky. Get over here. Excuse you? Get over here. <laughs> Man, you're no. in another, you're another city. Did you roll your d6 too? And you still got a six? Yes, I roll with with the lucky reroll. Uh, I... it's, a to, it's a hi. It's a total of 20. What? Wow. wow, okay. Hell yeah. Oh. I'm going to see if this, it, with your d20, but I'm going to see if they minus no they don't resist grabbing the principal but as they grab it seems like the doll hand can't really move its fingers so and the process drops thomas <laughs> and grabs the principal <laughs> now i'm going to see if their anger is going to overcome them no. oh no the principal's good as dead you guys <laughs> this is fine this is acceptable <laughs> no it's <laughs> To at least let this principal have a little bit more retribution. Uh, the doll hand just shakes him really aggressively. <laughs> I'm gonna <have> to be <laughs> con conscious. Roll. Like a doll, one might say. Yeah. <laughs> Picked me up with his mind powers and shook me like a doll. <laughs> a shook me like a dog. <laughs> Shake makes the principal pass out and rag dolls in the hand. Fair. Thomas, God. you can either stay where you are or run with the group. You oh, have well, I, I believe his turn is next, right? Yes, but it's a total free, like it's an additional action because. You oh, okay, cool. Yeah. Okay, I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna stay planted up in it because I I've, I've got I, I can't coordinate with my team because I can't hear shit. <laughs> but uh, I I clocked I clocked that pink elephant, so I've got an idea what I'm what I want, what I want to do with my turn. Nice. Right, Silas' turn is done. It goes to Thomas. Alrighty. I, I recognize that pink elephant, and I remember that I got the little little stuffed animal that I picked up and put in my, my waistcoat, so I'm going to pull that out and hold it up at one of the three faces. <laughs> Just like, remember who you are! <laughs> <laughs> well, as you do that, the, the two heads where one has just the mouth, the other one with the sealed mouth and eyes, the, the left and middle looks at it and in disgust just starts laughing at you you can't hear it but you can see the movement of them laughing but the elephant looks this eyes that was cold and empty starts to light up as you see as it sees the other half of its body and you can see a little tear coming from the corner of its eye what would you like to do with that other than <laughs> <laughs> Showing that it's a doll in your hand, bud. Uh, I'm, I mean, you do have your hey, hey, hey. because you have Roller. to do whatever you can to change your outfit. Whether you do have to make something on the spot with your sewing kit or with your brush or any any way to make a, an outfit to disguise yourself. Make you yourself look, look like a middle school feet. girl. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Okay. From the, the the last disguise that you <laughs> and now this, you're really it's a big ask. You're guys. <laughs> you're asking a lot. Okay. No, I'm but, getting a very yeah. like Corky Romano vibe where like every, it's just believable. Like, <laughs> like in universe, it's flawless. <laughs> but to the audience, <laughs> I mean, is. Sure, I guess. Do I? Do I? <laughs> this is the angle. Is this really you, it? Are you really gonna change into a schoolgirl? I mean, shit. Okay, okay, okay. Don't act, is, right? don't act surprised. You said like, hey, do you want to disguise into something? And you're surprised he says schoolgirl. Like, no, no, I didn't say schoolgirl. That wasn't me. That was lucky. I said you have a stone kit with your brush. I didn't say anything about changing into a middle school girl who Thomas is probably in his 30s. <laughs> I mean, really, I, I made a mistake in making an intellectual kind of character because I'm not smart enough or clever enough to be like, oh, what's that to do here? It's just like, uh, uh, it's stop whatever animal. Whatever you want to do, whatever you want to do, just do it. Whatever you think, just say it. What May I? Think? May that I pitch? Just, that was what I was thinking, was just hold the stuffed animal up and then maybe see what that does. 
Your, oh. May I pitch? You, you can use like your disguise role to like change your voice into what I assume this like cartoon like stuffed animal would speak like. Like maybe in oh. universe this stuffed animal oh. is from like a TV show and you're talking like the TV show. Uh, all right, I'll I'll take that. Yeah, let's do yeah. that, please. Okay. Yeah. Let's do it. Roll King. All right, King. but if this doesn't your work, twenty and when... six, and I'll give you a help roll from Silas for giving you that idea. Okay. <laughs> well, that, that I could not hear because. I'm deaf. Oh yeah. But you, you uh, mentally, ever since you guys bonded in the last place, vigorously <laughs> pantomiming a children's show. Oh my gosh. Okay, so that's an eight plus three. So that's what is that? Math eleven. Eleven. Okay. Yeah. What? 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 Um. In in any kid's voice, what are you gonna say to this? Oh, oh my god. <laughs> Why did I do this myself? <laughs> you <laughs> You're good at doing voices. You are so good at voices, dude. Hey. I love it. This is the move. Yep. Is that the move? Well, yes. 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 I love it. <clears throat> You look like a real nice character up there, and I don't think that uh, you've got so much in common with those other two freaky heads that you're, you're sharing a body with. Why don't you, why don't you just choose peace and not choose violence, huh? Never, never, never considered that. Just put, just put the nice man down. Oh, the the arm starts to go down as you're saying that, but the other arm's going to see him. The other heads try to force the resist and as as the hands going back and forth the other the far left head decides to do a surprise attack to you Ooh. and really quickly I'm gonna roll for because you have a shield you don't get hit but you feel that pressure of how hard Ooh. that head can uh, hit by just head well it's not head butting because it has no head but it forces his full face to go at you, but the shield blocks. But you can feel how for the force was, and that's really strong for just a head. But okay, the but the elephant head it seems to just be fixated on you and the uh, and the doll, and you can see a faint glow start happening in his eyes. And that's your turn. So progress. That was good progress. You're making progress. You're doing it. <laughs> honestly, helped a lot. So, we're going to go to Le oh, Thomas. Wait, no, Lady Lucille. <laughs> All right. Uh, I want to try with my little spirit box if I can like analyze the monster for any kind of like weak points, maybe. Like if there's any part of the body where like the energy is a little like off or something. Yeah. And okay, so that'd be it. D20 and a D6, correct? Because it's my box. Alright, I'll do the 20 first. Alright, that's a 10 plus... A 3. 13. Yeah, so your spirit box... Uh, what's your spirit box called again? The... The... Parker Watson spirit box. <laughs> the Parker Watson spirit box starts to detect uh, energy from the monster... I'm not talking like that. <laughs> <laughs> I'll try. Uh, the, 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 the text of spirit from within the dull body. You see huh. from the body, you're detecting multiple energies through this. Uh, As you guys uh, faced the first one, you saw two energies. This one has multiple that has more than three. And you're seeing that towards the lower half where all the cracks are and everything on the body that seems okay. like that's a weakness like there's nothing protecting it there okay so like the lower half of the whole lower half of the body or just like the abdomen the abdomen that right there the, in that little right or there's a little face that's staring <laughs> at you <hoping laughs> that you can join them in one day Oh gosh. Okay. <laughs> uh, I'll relay that to everyone else, but I'll also like uh, yell out to um, Silas and be like, "the the belly is the weak point. <laughs> Aim for there." Uh, are we are we fighting this thing? <laughs> I thought we were just kind of like hugging it. Ah. Uh, I'll I'll fight it. I'll. <laughs> well, your approach so far has has been to fight. So. 
<laughs> I'm just letting you know. Yeah, uh, is that all your turn is going to be? Yeah, pretty much all I can do right now. See, see, see. You throw your spirit box. No. <laughs> <laughs> all right, we're going to go back to the monster. So, uh, with the shield from from uh, not Thomas. Uh, <laughs> Sorry, Elm. We're gonna roll for your little fairy, unicorn, rainbow, glitter, spirit. <laughs> 17. Okay, yeah. Oh my god. No, it looks like Pinkie Pie. <laughs> oh god. Uh, <laughs> no, thank you. Oh no. No, thank you. Uh, we, <laughs> with this 17, all you guys are protected. Uh, Thomas is able to be protected by a 17, even though you are further away. Uh, Thomas, you also have your hearing back, so you don't need to worry about being um, deaf for a little bit. For now. For now. Yeah. Uh, yeah, for now. So, as the first head tries to attack, the shield stops it. The second one, we're going to see if the shields come back again. 15. The shields can't reach Thomas this time for the second attack. It's a... Let's see if they're actually going to be able to hit you. It does get a, a little whip its tail at Thomas. But it's still a small little whip that it doesn't cause you that, that much damage. You get like a 0.5 damage, Thomas, to it, but you're still oh. standing your ground. Okay, I'm just writing that down because that 0.5 is probably going to come into play later. <laughs> okay. The elephant is not attacking. The elephant actually looks at Thomas and asks, can you fix me? Oh, yeah. I'm gonna I'm gonna look real thoroughly in my uh, in my kit and see. But yeah, I think it's very doable. A little thread, a needle. Uh, not that kind of needle though. <laughs> <laughs> Roll for needle. No, I'm kidding. Oh god. Yeah. <laughs> kidding. It's kidding. Yeah. Yeah, we can fix you, bud. Uh, you for this since he's giving his turn to you, Thomas. I need you to roll a d20. Twice, and tell me oh, what the first and twice. second. Tell me what the first one is, and then I'll figure something out. Then tell me the second one. Okay, first one was a fourteen. Fourteen. Okay. Yes. You were able to dodge the attack again from the first head because it sees what you're trying to do, and it was trying to come after you. That little bitch. All right. <laughs> second day twenty. Holy cow! Where did that go? Oh my god! It was a fourteen again. <laughs> 14. It's, it's a 14, and it hit my other d20, which is also now a 14. That's a little bit <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. As the second head starts to do another whip, you have a 14, but the principal was able to wake up and grab the tail before it can reach you. Yeah. Uh -huh. And now he's holding on to it and being shaken at the same time. <laughs> yeah. yeah. It's not a good time for this principal. So, yeah, you can now... What are you going to do with the sewing kit? The pieces missing from the stuffed animal, those are the pieces that are on the monster? Yes. Okay. <laughs> I, don't, uh, I don't know if we can... Can we go about reattaching those? <laughs> so, <laughs> yeah. Uh, how? <laughs> it's attached to a big any... monster. So let's say you're closer to the head, maybe sewing the head to the body. Okay. Yeah. Don't worry about the other parts right now. Just worry about this head. All right. Because I was like, yeah. I don't. I don't. All right. Yeah. So if 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 I can get the can I can I like motion for the head to like lean down so that way I can start sewing the body back to the. Oh, his, his head's already close to you because he wanted to go talk to you. Or they. Oh, okay. Then then the yeah, perfect. Yeah. Do I have to scrounge for through my kit for some thread? Yes. Okay. Let me... Do you have any? <laughs> Roll for scrounging. Yeah. Roll for scrounge? Yeah, 12. It's only a minimum amount of thread you have right now in this tight situation. So as you are sewing the head, I'm going to see how good the principal is holding the tail whip for you. 18. He's doing great. Hey, keep it up, dude. You're doing great. And as you're still going, the head 
the other head. Oh, no, he did not roll really well. He tried to do pollen, but because the principal was holding on to the tail, the principal waxed the other head for you. <laughs> and the principal is like, hurry up. I am not made for this again. I'm allergic to air. Kalel, let's go. <laughs> allergic to air. All right. So, yeah, your sewing's going to take a while. So now the monster's turn is done. We're going to go to Lucky as you're still sewing. Okay. Um, I'm looking at the three heads. I see uh, Thomas is working on the elephant head. I'm going to eye the left face. Oh. Uh, Look at the angel like, hey, can you, let's, let's try and uh, distract the other two heads. I'm going to run up and if I can get the help of the spirit mm -hmm. uh, to smack the left face with my book and the spirit's help to try and, my goal is to try and use that light spirit energy to kind of make it bank off. So, okay, so you both are attacking, correct? Yeah. Okay, you're going to roll for yourself, and I'm going to roll for your spirit. I got a six. Oh, geez. I don't know what this is. Hold on. You got a six? Yeah. Uh, you are shielded, so when you go to attack, the head dodges, and as it was going to... Which one were you attacking? The left or the middle one? Left. Left. Uh, try to release more electrical pollen to you, but you are protected and shielded, so it, it didn't... You go ahead. Uh, do I am I still making that minus three? Oh yeah, it's... from the the lightning thing. Yes. Ooh, totally okay. Up. Then Ooh, then that's, that's, that's a that's a three, not a six. Wait, is that a six or a nine? Holy shit! Uh, we'll just call it six. Six and nine are right next to each other on the dice on this one, I, and that's I get you. It's bad. Uh, well, you still are protected from your yeah. spirit, but because you rolled light you like flipped as you fell <laughs> <laughs> um, but it leaves for another surprise attack for the top first head so we're gonna have him hey this is why this is why i don't act a hero your spirit was able to distract the middle one but because she's distracting she couldn't stop the second attack from the first one so more electrical current went through you and you will take a damage of Four. Okay. All right. So that is that your turn? Yep. You guys, you were able to at least distract them. Uh, we're going to go. To Hooray! <laughs> My plan worked, guys. <laughs> yeah. Silas. Oh. Uh. So I'm, I'm like conflicted because like w w we have word that like this the center body is a weak point, but. We're also like trying to unbully this person, and attacking them doesn't feel like unbullying. So I don't. I'm not really sure where how to go forward. That's why I'm out of character. That's why I'm targeting the other two heads, because those two seem to be the darker emotions that we want to beat back. I also got word that there's multiple spirits in this. Multiple spirits. And w w what I think I understand is that each head is a spirit plus the body, which makes me believe, and this is all conjecture, I have no idea for sure, but like Sierra is like the body and she's kind of like puppeting the bullies, which are, which are each of the heads. And I, I, I'm not exactly sure what our what our end goal is here. What is your end goal? I mean, just just to get through this, and the principal doesn't have to survive, but <laughs> I'm, more worried, I'm more worried about Sierra. Uh, then you know what, buddy? Just give give her a hug. <laughs> What's the worst that could happen? Hey, Nick, what gave you a hug? We have what? been told that it's it's lonely. There are multiple spirits. The body seems to be the the centered area. If okay, yeah, it's a good uh, idea. Yeah. How about what is the body like made of? I know it's like a spirit, but like the the head on the right feels like it's made of like a stuffed animal material. Like, is is the body stuffed animal? Is it like a ceramic with cracks? Like, like, like what's cracks? You see, like the body and the the baby doll hand, they're ceramic. While the one of the legs and the tail is stuff, okay. stuffed animal stuff, and then the grape bits are literally the spirit flesh itself. Okay. Okay. Um, that makes it harder. I'm gonna, I'm gonna like, 
I've been holding my cane like a bat and like a weapon. I'm just kind of kind of like slide it down to where it's just kind of like, like short hafting it and then just kind of hold everything up in front of me to like block anything, any attacks that show up while I'm approaching and then just slowly and gently just kind of like hug the the entire body uh, with a close up to my face. It was just, just just like bright eye, like narrow pupil, like scared out of my mind, but just like, don't worry. It's, it's, oh, it's you rock. Sierra, it's it's okay. When when is when is your next birthday? Well, no. When you uh, said that, as Thomas is still sewing and everything, you say that. Oh, um, can you roll a d twenty for me, Joe? I you cannot say this roll. is this is not your. No, this is not fighting skills. That's <laughs> that would be weird. Um, <laughs> I already yeah. used my luck roll to to make sure Thomas got out of its grasp, which I think was a good use. But now I'm afraid of what this roll is going to you, be. You you have a luck roll because you have Bob. Oh, interesting. Well, I have a, I rolled a 16, so I'm happy with that. You are good. You do not need Bob's roll. Mm -hmm. Bob Bob is also hugging as you are hugging it. Appreciateness, <laughs> <laughs> as you say. When's your next birthday? The elephant kind of twitches, and you the voice sounds more like a little girl and says, the, the 20, October 29th, are, are you gonna go? Are you gonna, I will make sure to be wherever the party is at whenever the party may be. As you say that, the center of the body lights up and this begins to shake, but because of this, the other two heads are going to try to stop you. The first head does not do anything because you are protected by the first light. The first, uh, two. Oh. Ooh, the first light's the name of the spirit. That's great. The first light, uh, I like first that, light. yeah. <laughs> the second one, though, the tries the whip. And we're going to roll to see if this principle is still holding on as it's being shaken still. I can take a hit, that's fine. Yes, it takes the, he, the principal takes the hit for you and still holding on to the tail, but they're getting really angry with the principal stopping them. That's fine. <laughs> wow, all right. Um, the principal, it, they slam the principal to the ground repeatedly over and over again. Oh and God. Unconscious and you see a pool of blood starting to come out from oh. underneath him. I'm, 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 I'm hugging. I'm, I'm, uh, I'm doing the priority thing right now. <laughs> sure. <laughs> but he's still conscious and breathing. As you can see, he's heavily breathing. Arguably worse. Actually, <laughs> <laughs> the light from the center starts to glow. The elephant is finishing up. Lucy, it is your turn. Uh, sorry. Mm -mm. Uh, the why is that? What have been calling you? Lucille Parker Watson. No, no, no. Lady Lucille. Lady Lucille Parker Watson's <laughs> turn next. Please, <laughs> Madame, make your turn. Ah, uh, um, yes. Um. <laughs> so did uh, did we all hear that the birthday is coming up soon? Yes, it's like you this did. month, right? Yeah. Ah, uh, okay. Okay, then Lucy will be like, oh, it's your birthday soon. Well, allow me to be the official planner of your upcoming birthday party. I will book the 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 fanciest and most expensive circus. Uh, what's your what's your favorite cake flavor? What's your favorite color? She she hears this and as you're you're saying this, the light in the center gets brighter and brighter. Uh, and she says would you ask you said cake and color? Cake and color, yeah. It's it's pink and I like I like strawberry with vanilla. Ah, fantastic choice. You, you don't think those are dumb? Oh, the, they're wonderful choices. I I also love strawberries and pink. Tears starts to roll down the elephant's face and Thomas, you are finishing up but the heads get two attacks. The first one does not is not able to do anything. You're all shielded because it sucks. As the second one, because the tail is free. <laughs> it rolled a three. Um, <laughs> <laughs> it rolled a three, and you are about to get the closest person to it is well, technically it's Silas. Tries to whip, but Bob grabs it and goes mm -hmm. no, no. 
I was thinking he gets caught on the principle. <laughs> <laughs> Unconscious body is still being dragged around. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> but it now has a free hand since it's done beating the shit out of the principal <laughs> and grab Silas. Silas, you are holding on to the body. I need you to roll resistance real quick. Two. You do not resist. Oh, no. It grabs you and rips you from the body. Bob was able to stay hugging onto it. Okay, good. Someone's still hugging it. And slams you on the ground about three times. Oh, God. Four. Oh, How much damage? Nine. Nine. Uh, so, so I'm, I'm being slammed in the ground with every slam. Sierra! <laughs> Happy birthday! <laughs> I can't make it to your birthday if I'm... <laughs> She lifts, they lift you one more time to do one more blow to you. But as you say that, Thomas finishes up sewing the elephant. And uh, the light from the center starts to blind all the owl, all the heads, and the hand stops. And the body starts to twitch. And you hear the voice from the elephant. You won't hurt anyone else, the, the elephant head looks at you and said aim for the stone aim i can't hold on forever silas that's kind of your i mean silas that's your turn <laughs> so my turn's done yeah well you could oh no you didn't get a turn just kidding just kidding um silas since uh you were let go you can get a surprise attack towards them if you have the energy for it i don't know how many health you have i have two uh, oh, my God. oh, no, you don't. <laughs> <laughs> We're just gonna. Um, so it was Lady, the monster, and then now it's back to Lucky. Everyone from now on is gonna get one attack, and that's all you can do for this moment in time. All right, give me a second. Still flat on my back. Oh yeah, <laughs> don't stretch or anything. So you're just. Um, I take out. I'm. 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 I look for the the look for the stone on this thing is it the the chest piece in the center of the chest me all right uh i take out one of my scissor knives and i throw it at that which and the heads are the other two heads even though they're twitching they're see if they can pay attention but no <laughs> that's a one on their part uh oh, they the second head rolled a three yeah they suck <laughs> as you throw the knife it hits into the stone and you can start seeing it's cracking and the elephant goes almost not quite Bob what you do it oh, oh yeah Bob. oh I forgot that Bob do is there it. it is technically my summon so I'm assuming it'll go on my turn <laughs> yeah 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 Bob tries to start inches it a little bit more in but slips and says my lord I tried and falls and bounces away because he's a little uh, bubble boy oh, you're okay oh. buddy Quick. good job I proud of you <laughs> that's your turn it goes to Silas who is on the floor still so so am I being pinned down by a hand or can I get no. up no no you can oh. get up uh, I'm just gonna get up and then just like bleeding and like black eye uh, just hobbling over, I slowly like pick up speed, raise my cane up, and with like the 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 raven point skull, I just jam it into the into the stone like a pickaxe. They're all for defense because they can't do anything to stop you. Let's see if they can. The first one throws pollen at you, but because it's in the air, I'm gonna see if it actually accurately hits you because it's being uh kind of like restricted. No, it just keeps throwing it in the air, and it actually hits the middle head, and they they don't do anything about that. It tries to whip you, but it doesn't. It's just whipping its tail back and forth. Uh, as you do that, the final blow to the stone cracks, and all the lights from inside appears, but you hear a screech go through the entire school, and as... A light blinds you. The light appears, and you see when it disappears, you see several kids on the ground, and one of them you can see looks different from the rest. 
and you say little Sierra. Oh. That's that that that's the murderer right there. <laughs> <laughs> she didn't murder anyone. As I'm at two health. <laughs> <laughs> right. Sierra, you're not murdered. <laughs> you're not murdered. Sierra comes to and she raises and when Thomas when you sewed it together, you see in your hand a complete elephant doll. Aw, I, I give the elephant doll to Sierra. And she looks at you, and she gives you a big hug. Oh, okay. And she starts to cry, because, thank you, I didn't want to hurt anyone, but they kept telling me I had to. Yeah, that's usually how it goes. I didn't mean to, I'm sorry, I just, I've been bullied so long, I didn't know it was good or not. It's just, I just wanted to make it through day by day. Thank you. Thank you for fixing my doll. Oh, of course, of course, of course. I, can, I, can I, like, give, like, a reassuring, like, shoulder pat? <laughs> yeah. Okay. She, she takes it and she, she glows. And a bunch of the other kids... I'm not drawing them. <laughs> <laughs> they, they wake up and they... Two of them... Wakes up, sorry, not all of them. But two of them wakes up and goes... Uh, wh- where where are we? And they look over and they go, Sierra, what are- is this your fault? Why are you always causing so much problems? Right. Oh, these <laughs> these kids are gonna get their fucking teeth kicked in. <laughs> <Sort of. laughs> sure. Now before we get on to whatever your problem is, I need to and and Silas Sy- kind of wipes his face. I can't tell if I'm crying from the tender moment or if I'm bleeding. Can someone tell me he holds a hand out of whatever material is happen to be pouring from his face? Uh, you two can kindly shut the fuck up. And they both look, but we're kids. Which one of you slammed me against the floor three times? <laughs> the, one of them just looks away from you really quickly and just, just fiddles with their fingers. Fantastic, and I go to the, I'm assuming the, the body of the principal is still unconscious, right? Yeah. Cool, and I lift him up, do your worst, and I just kind of throw him <laughs> throw him at the girls, and uh, and I just start to leave. Sierra looks at them, and she sticks her tongue out in them and says, You guys are mean, I'm not going to help you anymore. And yeah, you guys save Sierra. Uh, you guys should probably go back to the shed. Oh yeah, Let's all go back that's where I'm going. Shed. Yeah, now, <laughs> yeah. Like, let me ask you: Do you guys want to bring these kids and the principal back with you to the shed? Uh, uh, not. No, should. No. <laughs> should yes, but you know, <laughs> maybe you should, maybe you shouldn't. Up to you. The outcome may change or may not. Up to you. I, I think that the right thing to do, as much as I want to be vindictive, is to just bring them all back to the shed. Hopefully there's space. And hope <laughs> that like the presence of Opal and Darian and Rose will keep some of these little shitheads in, ta- in check. We're telling them the entire story about... Everything. Principal covering oh. up bullying, right? Oh yes, of course. Oh, absolutely. And they'll and they'll they'll, okay. see, they'll see justice. Yeah. So yeah okay. when, cool. When you guys take everyone back to the shed, um Begrudgingly. Yeah. <laughs> begrudgingly, begrudgingly. Silas, I know you see Opal, but Opal actually gets more red and flustered because you have more scars on you and that's, <laughs> <laughs> that's a bad sign As she, she hugs her sister she goes Tiara I was so worried about you and hugs her and Darian hugs and goes my daughter and she cries in their arms and you guys tell them everything and Darian is in infused with rage at what happened and what's been going on, he goes up to, her, to the principal and goes, I trusted you with my daughter. And this is what you do to her? And he looks at the other kids and he goes, you will hear about this. Your futures are over. 
And the kids, of course, start crying. And Sierra goes, "No, Dad, we'll I will we'll take care of it in school. Don't ruin don't ruin this their life." Yeah, fucking schoolyard justice. Hell yeah. <laughs> Leave me by the flagpole. <laughs> Sam, Sam leans in towards the uh, the principal and like nods over to Silas. Like, yeah, see, he was right. The scars. He was right about the scars. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> he's 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 leaning over to me while I'm uh. You gesture toward me while I'm like reaching into like my bags and stuff to pull out something that looks similar to the Parker Watson personal electro spiritual magnifier, but it, instead <laughs> it, I start putting a different version like around my belt, like like it's a belt, and I pull out another like 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 a shocker oh, device, and it just. This is like like deep breaths, and I start shocking myself. <laughs> it's, it's one of those like like belts that like tense your muscles, right? Uh, yes. And I'm and I I did research on this. This is a real thing, and he Silas believes this with his life. Uh, it is believed that if you shocked your your pelvic region, it made you manlier. <laughs> <laughs> I did some real like like pseudo wacko science from the Victorian era. Jesus. This is real. <laughs> so I'm doing that to recover health. No. Oh Opal has to look away and remind herself that she's engaged. <laughs> wow. After seeing him electrocute his junk, I think he wouldn't have to remind right. herself. Opal's into, some, <laughs> Opal's into some stuff, man. Uh, uh, okay, no, you know what? That's fair. Opal. Um, <laughs> heals everyone there because with her, oh, I was, her I was gonna say, while he's well, he's electrocuting himself. I'm just gonna ask my spirit deity of goodness to heal me up. Oh, yeah, okay, yeah, your <laughs> spirit deity is helping you mm. for the rest who can't have spirit deities or electrical junk, they have to get <laughs> healed by Opal and Rose, and they're helping. And Darian is really trying hard not to finish off the principal, but the principal is completely apologizing and saying they'll do whatever uh, to gain the trust of the Olin family again and for now the, the captain just says just, let's have peace for now till we figure out exactly what's going on as a, a big blinding light from the town center of pink raises in the, the center and it just it, 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 it fades away I can't say the other word fades away what it is, we don't know until the next episode, everyone. Oh Bye. my god. Dun, dun, dun. You guys save Sierra and put those bullies in their place. Yippee! And nearly killed a principal, but that's not your fault. <laughs> that's, that's no, fine. No I'll take responsibility yeah, for that. <laughs> I'm, I'm, assuming, I'm assuming my deity yeah. uh, dissipates after this, yeah? Yes. Uh, yeah. That was the entity NVIDIA. Which is the Dark Lord of Envy. Sierra tells you all this. <laughs> oh, oh, the okay. thing that we fought. The thing we fought. Yeah, yeah I thought you were fought. talking about the. I thought you were talking about the good deity. I thought you were talking about. I thought you were talking about the good deity, and then you were naming it after a visual dri driver, like <laughs> the yeah, Nvidia I was graphics. Say, ah, yes. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. So, yeah, you guys were able to help her get to her senses and stop the envy that's within her for everyone always having time with her family and she's just really grateful to have now this time with her family uh, and you will get more in the next episode as I said so earlier yeah, bye. 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 say yeah. bye everyone you did already bye 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 goodbye I hope you oh. only get one ring the bell for more well, bye now follow and everything <laughs> <laughs> Ring that bell. Smash that like button. <laughs> Smash that like button. <laughs> and guys, in the next episode, goodbye.